What's up guys and welcome back to another Destiny video. We are at the reef. Today is July 31st, Friday, which means it is Zer Day. Zer is located in his usual spot over here in the far right section of the reef. He's got a few decent items on this week, but uh, let's take a look. For the Titan, he's got the no backup plans, strength upgradable 103. I think the highest stat roll you can get is 121 maybe, 120, but I mean, overall, I'd pass. There's better exotics for the Titan overall. Uh, for the Hunter, we have the Knucklehead Radar. Strength upgradable 106. Again, low on the stat roll again, but it is a solid helmet overall. The fact you get third eye with all primary weapons is a good perk to have. If you don't have it for your Hunter, definitely recommend picking it up. But yeah, besides that, uh, go with a couple of Ingrams to see if you can get a little bit higher. Uh, for the Warlock, we have the Claws of Ahamkara. Split stat roll discipline upgradable to 58 strength upgrade upgradable is 68 the highest you can get is 70 for each So overall these are pretty good and the fact you get two melees so like two scorch melees. Yeah, everyone knows about the warlock scourge <laughs> But yeah, definitely pick these up good stat roll in this week and a good uh, gauntlets overall for the warlock For the gun we have the Soros regime We'll have to see with the taken king if this gun becomes back on or goes back on to top tier I'd say pick it up if you don't have it, but I'm sure everyone by now has it, so we'll have to see. Yeah, like I said, we'll have to see with the Taken King, but I think the patch actually comes out before before the Taken King comes out, but we'll have to see. And we have the exact Shars and exact Ingrams. Definitely pick some of those if you don't have the RAM by now. We have Pulse Rifle Telemetry, Scout Rifle Telemetry, Sniper Rifle Telemetry, Plasma Drive, Emerald Coil, Heavy Ammo, and Mode of Light. As always, guys, thanks for watching, and I'll see you later.